Hey everybody, Mike Earth Apple Tech 128 Wheels, and today I'm going to show you how to make sure Touch ID always works. Let's get started. If you're like me and have an iPhone 5S, you probably use Touch ID every single day, multiple times a day, as your main way to unlock the phone. I never use my passcode to unlock it. I only use it when I reboot my phone because you have to enter your passcode every time you reboot your phone. But other than that, I never use the passcode. My thumb is the main way of unlocking it and I'm very happy with it. It's super easy. It always works really quickly if it actually reads it correctly. But it works really good when it wants to work. Several times a day, it keeps telling me try again, try again, try again. And eventually, if it keeps telling me try again, it's just going to keep getting it wrong over and over and over. And it's going to keep making you enter your password. And then eventually, when it comes down to finally getting your finger right, it would have just been a lot quicker to enter that passcode instead of having to rescan your finger over and over and over and over again. So I'm going to show you how to make sure Touch ID always works, or most of the time. Because Touch ID is a new software, new thing, it's not going to work great all the time. So what you want to do is head on to settings in general, then click passcode and fingerprint. So you're going to enter your password, and then click on fingerprints. Then, as you can see right here, I have my left and right thumb set up. So I have one for each. And this will work best if you have one, but if you have two fingers set up, that will work too. So what you're going to do is set up all of your fingers that you can, all of the slots that it can fill. Right now, you can only set up to five fingers on the iPhone 5S. So that's what we're going to do. But it's going to be on the same finger. So we can do two on one finger, three on the other. Or if you only use one finger, we could do five on that one finger. So that's right, we are going to set up five fingerprints for the same finger. So you just go through, set them all up, and I have done this before. I did it earlier today. And I have to say it does work a lot better than it would if you only had one, since it is a new thing, and it's not going to get it right all the time. And I did notice it messed up a couple of times, but it does work a lot better than it would be for, but still, it's not working perfectly, and I just think it's probably better just to have five different fingers set up and have your um. So anyway, that's just some cool tip I found out, and let me know what you think. Try it out for yourself. Let me know if it worked in the comment section below. If you like this video and helped you out, be sure to hit that like button. Subscribe for more videos, and I will see you right back here in the next one. Thanks for watching.